you are welcome guys to this channel and right now i'm going to teach you how to check the number of unique values in each column of a pandas data frame so this is an intuitive way of doing it and uh, rather than you trying to get the unique values in each columns and you write the codes you know one by one so i'm going to teach you how to write like uh just a, a a chunk of codes to to automate that you know in your jupyter notebook so let's get started so i'm going to read in a data set now which i will use uh to practice or uh, you can try it on your own data set okay the first thing is for us to import pandas as pd since we are going to be using pandas so i'm going to bring in my data set now pd dot read underscore csv so the name of the data set so i run it okay done we can view the head And that is the head. Okay. Uh, I can go ahead and view the shape. That's the shape. I can also view the data types for each of the columns. And that is it. So what I'm actually arriving at is to check the unique values in each of these columns. So I get to have an idea of what each columns contain. I mean the unique values there. Uh, let's add more cells. And one last thing here is to check there's any missing value and you can see no missing value okay so right now we can now go ahead and write this code to automate checking of unique values in each of the columns here you can see this is having like six columns so we are going to check the unique values in each of the columns and it's going to print it out for us you know right away and that saves a lot of time so i'm going to write this i will explain it to you later so this is a for loop as you can see a python for loop which is going to print the number of unique values in then there will be an order here which is going to hold uh, the name for each columns as the loop goes through uh, goes through the data frame so this is going to hold the name for each column visited by the for loop so the number of unique values in then I'm going to have a line break here. Then after that, the unique values are then another order here. Okay, so uh, that's how that will be now the next thing is for me to now uh, go ahead and complete the for loop so this second part we check for the values now going through 
row by row through each of the columns. Okay. So format. Put this down. Yeah. So to go through the lens, and I. So this I stands for each value, each value row by row in a column. Okay. So this I dot format I the len len means is now going to check each value row by row down a column and it's going to print out the unique values so let's go ahead and complete it dot unique and uh, rent So, and we want to finish it up it's the last print here, and I will have a style like this, uh, let me put it like this, yeah. Okay, so uh, this is the code. So you can see this is uh, the number of unique values in bedroom. We have four values there, and that is it uh, for also the parking, the toilet. So these are the number that is the counts of unique values in each of the columns of our data free. So now uh, I will make an adjustment to this code, you know, uh, so that can print out those actual values for us, you know, just as I said, not just the counts of each unique values in, in, in each column, you know. So I'm going to add here column R, uh, then there will be another order here. So you can see another order here, which is going to now hold uh, the values. So we will have them print out apart from the accounts. Okay. So I'm going to uh, rerun this code now. Okay. Okay. Good. So now you can see, and I have the list of all the 27 unique values on that location then all the 20 unique values on the rent rent column all the unique values on that bedroom there are four in number and these are the four of them under the toilet i have five unique values and these are the five of them okay so uh that is how to use a for loop to iterate through your data frame and to automate the printing of unique values in each column so thank you and happy programming in python